It's GeForce Now Thursday, and we have some pretty exciting news to go over, including new games arriving on the service this week. But before we get into that, we have to start with the biggest headline of the day, and that's the fact that 3080 membership is now going to be available on a one-month tier. No longer does it require a six-month commitment, you can just pay $19.99 a month and go month-to-month -month on your 3080 membership. Now this is a huge deal, not only because, hey, more options are always a good thing in terms of how you pay for your service, but because it now gives it entry to people who want to try it out just to see what it's all about. You've already heard again and again how much I love the 3080 tier, and there's good reason for that, but now I'm glad that you can experience it if you're very curious to try it out for yourself but didn't want to commit to 6 months up front. I've seen plenty of comments in my videos and have had friends and family very interested in the 3080 tier but just couldn't commit to paying so much without being able to try it first, and honestly speaking, I can't blame them. This now changes all of that, and I'm really glad to see it being introduced so soon after the launch of the 3080 tier itself. As a reminder, the 3080 membership gives access to 1440p streaming at 120 frames per second on PCs, native 1440p or 1600p at 120fps on Macs, and 4K HDR at 60fps on Shield TV. Or if you choose to, you can still sign up for a 6 month 3080 membership and get 1 month free. That's available at $99.99. Also, Founders members who have been with GeForce Now from the very beginning can also receive an additional 10% off the subscription price and can upgrade with no risk to their Founders for Life benefits. But now, let's get to the games arriving this week on GeForce Now. We're going to be highlighting all the new releases coming this week, and then I'll go over the list of games also getting support. First up is Buccaneers, a new release that'll be available on Steam. This is a game where you can play as a fearless captain in a classic pirate RPG game. You'll find legendary treasures, battle powerful ships, change the course of history, and join one of the unique factions to conquer an ever-changing Caribbean sea. If you find yourself wanting to work your way up from a small-time pirate to a legendary captain, this is the game for you. Following that, we have Distant Worlds 2, which is also available on Steam. It's described as a vast, possible, real-time 4x space strategy game. Experience the full depth and detail of turn-based strategy, but with the simplicity and ease of real-time and on the scale of a massively multiplayer online game. Huge galaxies of up to 2,000 star systems and tens of thousands of planets, moons, and asteroids are yours to explore and exploit. Whether peacefully through mining and diplomacy, or by conquest, you'll have plenty of choices to make here. And the last new release arriving this week is Ironsmith Medieval Simulator, available on Steam. In this game, you'll learn and unlock new skills, trade to earn gold and stock up on resources, craft tools, items, weapons, and armors, and truly live that Ironsmith medieval experience. As per usual on the channel, I always try and keep it real with you all, I would highly suggest you go and check out the Steam review page because it's rated at mostly negative right now. This might be the type of title you want to hold off on and wait to see if it gets updated and fixed throughout. While that does cover all the new releases, I did need to talk about one more game that's getting a big DLC add-on. And that's Assassin's Creed Valhalla Dawn of Ragnarok. The new downloadable content will be available starting today. You'll be able to unleash new divine powers and embark on a quest through a breathtaking world to save your son and complete a legendary Viking saga. Three other games will be getting GFN support this week, and that includes Bus Driver Simulator, Martha is Dead, and Survival Quiz City, all available on Steam. And with that, we wrap up this GFN Thursday. If you enjoyed the video or found it helpful at all, be sure to hit that like button as it really does help the channel out and if you're wanting more content like this be sure to subscribe and hit that notification bell as well as always this has been the virtual cloud giving you the latest and greatest on everything cloud gaming related and until next time i'll catch you in the clouds